the boom more clap in this.
like the speed of sound We can keep on the ground Can't stay in one place Keep moving like a bullet train Like a bullet train
transporter build. Um, I'll just give you guys a run through of everything that we've done on this van. Um, always happy with the, the end result, um, especially the transporters. We love transporters here at Insight Van Conversions. So uh, I'll give you guys the rundown. Double bed um, with a pull out table. This is fully removable. You can take this out and set it up wherever you want. Legs just uh, fold down and lock out. You can set that up underneath your awning or um, on this van, we've got a um, bench seat that comes down, that folds out. Just clip your supports in and then you can sit down Put your table there, you can eat breakfast, watch the surf, chill, have a beer in the afternoon. Um, it's a good good use of space and it also just um, finishes off the uh, surfboard cavity so um, everything's just, just a lot neater. Rear pull out kitchen on extra heavy duty drawer runners. Um, they're locking so if you park on a slope it's not gonna slide back in on you. Um, butane double burner cooktop. Uh, underneath this is um, storage space for all your cutlery, utensils, um, spare butane canisters, um, anything like that. And underneath here is some storage um, for a pantry, so all your food in there. It just folds away nicely. Moving into the interior, uh, insulated with thermal insulation and acoustic insulation on the um, walls and just thermal insulation on the roof and the floor um, and also lined in pine lining boards uh, the whole way around. Um, the floor is done um, in with a ply base and a floating floor. This one got like a natural wood um, dark timber finish. We've painted the walls and roof white. Um, white helps make a small space bigger. It's also um, one of my favorite things to do in a fit out. Um, the wardrobe, the standard wardrobe and bedside table that we do um, in most of our transporters. Uh, lift off bedside table with storage underneath there. Um, open hanging space for all your clothes and also goes down so you can put all socks undies and um, bits and pieces down there all folded along there this van is fitted with our off-grid electrical system uh, so it has solar charging and vehicle charging uh, two 120 amp hour deep cycle AGM batteries um, uh, roof fan for ventilation. Um, this is a Dometic uh, fantastic fan. Uh, we use them on our all our fit outs. They're absolutely fantastic, pun intended. We've got USB um, outlets for phone charging and a SIG socket for 12 volt appliances like laptop chargers or whatever. Um, a bedside light, so if you wake up in the night uh, you don't want to blind yourself if you just need to get up or something so you just flick that on um, also this van has a usb point and a hdmi endpoint up there it is going to have a projector and screen just has not been um, installed it's going to be done later on down the track um, also the stereo system got upgraded in this van to a multimedia player with reverse camera, Apple Play and rear speakers and front upgraded speakers. Uh, it's a nice addition to get when you, when you get your fit out. Just makes the whole inside of the van just a lot newer and more user friendly. It's great to have a reverse camera when you're reversing um, because there's a lot of blind spots in a van. Uh, also, we've got a 95 litre fridge. This fridge also has a small freezer section. Um, we've got 240 volt inverter. So you have 240 volt power no matter where you are. Um, and 
you just turn that remotely on and off from here so you're not using power if you're not using 240. And we've also got another storage drawer at the front for towels and I use mine for wetsuits and everything like that. Um, and the side wings, as usual, pull off and there's storage underneath there. So that is uh, pretty much everything in this van. I hope you guys enjoyed the, the walk around um, and I'll roll on some clips of some close-ups of everything now. We are the more club in this. Thank you.